For those of you joining me for the first time during the junior sermon, I'm Joe Bruce, Director of Children's Ministries at Hamlin Park Presbyterian Church. This morning, I want to read you a story. As I read, I want you to listen very carefully for some special words. Here are the three words I want you to listen for. Candy, eggs, and bunny. Let's read our story from the New Testament in the Bible. On the first day of the week, very early in the morning, Mary Magdalene and Mary, the mother of James, took the spices they had prepared and went to the tomb. They found the stone rolled away from the tomb. But when they entered, they did not find the body of the Lord Jesus. While they were wondering about this, suddenly two men in clothes that gleamed like lightning stood beside them. In their fright, the women bowed down with their faces to the ground. But the men said to them, why do you look for the living among the dead? He is not here. He has risen. Remember how he told you while he was still with you in Galilee? Hmm. Did you hear any of the three words, egg, candy, or bunny in the story? I didn't. I don't understand. I just read you the Easter story. No candy, no eggs, no bunnies? Well, the fact is, Easter is not really about candy. It's not about colored eggs or bunny rabbits either. It's not even about new clothes. The Bible does tell us that the angels who appeared to Mary and the other were wearing bright, shining clothes. But the Easter bunny and Easter eggs have become part of our celebration of Easter. And there's nothing wrong with that as long as we remember what Easter is really about. Easter is really about Jesus and the good news that he's alive. When Mary and her friends finally realized Jesus was alive, do you know what they did? They hurried and told their other friends. As soon as you finish the worship service at home this morning, I'd like you to start telling your family these simple words. He is risen. And they can say back to you, He is risen indeed. Let's pray. Lord God, we thank you for this opportunity to, this morning to come and celebrate the risen Lord and that the tomb is empty, and Jesus is alive. Thank you. In your name we pray. Amen. He is risen.